everyone, my name is Gina and today's video is going to be a Project TBR and 0x16 update. So if you guys have watched my videos from the beginning of the year, you know that I'm kind of trying to participate in Project TBR and that I like the idea of 0x16. 0x16 is basically a goal to get your TBR of books that you own, obviously, because let's face it, our TBRs are always growing and are continuous and pretty much infinite. But the books out that you own, it is a goal to get that down to zero. I have way too many books on my shelf that I own that I have not read that zero by 16 really isn't doable for me. Maybe zero by 17, that might be a more accurate thing. But Project TBR is along the same lines, only instead of getting it down to zero, you are getting your TBR to be less than what you started with. If you are not new to this channel and you have seen some of my most recent videos, you know that I had a huge book haul back in February. So basically my TBR has gotten squished. But not really, because it's actually gotten bigger. But the idea is that Project TBR has gotten squished. That is where I am going with that. So this is just kind of an update to let you know how I'm doing with this. It is April, mid-April when I'm filming this. Hopefully I'll get this up soon. But I think Project TBR is going well. As of filming this, I have read 22 and a half-ish books. I'm not necessarily counting Mistborn because I have not finished that, but I did have to give it back to the library, so I don't actually own that copy of that book, so I can't finish it at the moment. But I am counting the 200 pages that I have read of Mistborn to my page counts of what I have read because I am keeping track of how many pages I have read this year as well as how many books I have read this year. So in that aspect, Project TBR is going pretty good. I've read a handful of books. I've almost hit, hit the amount of books that I read last year. So I think that's pretty good. I think that's pretty good. So if you guys have seen my Project TBR video, you know that I am only counting the books in my room on my main bookshelf as the TBR for this year. And also some of these books because some of these books I haven't read either. Obviously I've read all of my Harry Potter books. But anyway, those are the only books that I am counting. I have kind of manipulated it a little bit. I have taken books upstairs that I do want to read. It just, I know I'm not going to get to them this year and I don't want to get rid of them because I do want to read them. Most of the books upstairs are parts of series that I know I'm not going to get to yet. Some of the books upstairs are also old library, like haul books from library sale and used books. So there's more upstairs, just keep that in mind. But for the most part, the books on my main bookshelf, which really only take up three of the five shelves because the fourth shelf is all of my Anita Blake books and the fifth shelf is just really hard to get to because of the way my room is set up. So I really don't have any books on there at all. But I'm going to go count the books that are on that bookshelf and I will let you know how many are on my TBR as of mid-April. Just an update on what my shelf looks like now because I did a TBR shelf tour which I had put the main books that I had read on my top shelf and my other two shelves were TBR books but I was tired of looking at that so I kind of kind of color coordinated my shelves a little bit. I don't know how much you can see that but you know it's there. Okay so out of the books that I have on my bookshelf in here and the five right there, which I almost forgot about. I have 105 books on my TBR. There is no way I am going to read 105 books between now and January 1st of 2016. There's just no way. I mean, it might be doable if like all I did was read, but I have a job and I have other life things and friends, so that's not gonna happen. However, I'm hoping to maybe at least cut that down. I would like to get 80 on my TBR by 2016. I think that's a doable goal because my birthday is coming up and I know I'm gonna get more books for my birthday because I just, it's, it's you know, who doesn't get books for their birthday or at least book gift cards. So my goal is to have 80 books on my TBR by the time 2015 is up. That is definitely doable, especially if I keep reading books that I own and not buying too many more books. But I know I'm gonna keep buying books because, let's face it, we're book people and 
I books are my addiction so I am going to keep buying books and let me also say that the TBR books also do not count books on my Kobo because those aren't physical books like I have them electronically which there's a few on there as well so I don't know I might go through my shelves eventually and pick out a set number of books that I want to read this year and try to do that and that will help with my TBR and it will also help get things off my shelves and it will also help kind of with a reading goal. That being said, I kind of already did that. Back in December, Denny and I had decided to make our goals 30 books for this year. Then we bumped it up to 35 and pretty soon I'm probably going to bump it up to 50 because I'm at like 23 books on the year or something like that. And I found the list that I made of the books that I wanted to read this year, the 30 books that I wanted to read this year. As you can kind of see, I haven't crossed many of them off. Out of these 30 books that I wanted to read this year, I have read five. Again, I have read over 20 books this year so far. I have only read five out of the ones that I had planned on reading. So that just is another factor to show that I'm not good at TBRs and planned reading and I'll probably make a video about that soon. I don't really know. But that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below how your TBRs are going for this year. And also if you're participating in either 0x16 or Project TBR, I'd love to know. As always, links to everything in the description below. Again, thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye.